My dear Horatio, I find myself in a highly unexpected situation. I awoke after deep slumber to discover that I was no longer Prince of Denmark. Death or heaven had worked some strange magic on me, and I found that I was no longer me, rather someone else. This place seems quiet, but fraught with danger. Still, I have been attempting to make the best of the situation, familiarising myself with my surroundings. I doth not know whether I am, or whither thou art, or if to be true we are in Denmark at all. So I trust in the speed of fast-moving waters to sweep my words to you, wherever thou art. The more I dwell on it, the more I believe that this world be some betwixt two. Am I dead? Hath my soul entered some strange limbo which, like swift rain, follows death as night follows day? What other tortured souls may linger here? I am Hamlet, Prince of Denmark. Tell me, what, what souls linger in your beastly vessels? But they were naught but cows. Oh, Horatio, that you were here to comfort that life is naught but a daring adventure. If it be true, only my father would send with me a sign, some confirmation of my success in avenging his murder. Good Horatio, I believe that my father is here. A silent apparition gone like smoke whenever I approach. On occasion I fancy I glimpse... Spirit! Stay! I am not mad. Ha! Huh. All in? Great man. As am I. To be or not to be cycles in perpetual monotony. One as unappealing as the other. When will my father come? Is this to me my reward for avenging his death? And yet, was all that bloodshed worth avenging one man, already dead and buried? Oh, if my father could be here to guide my feet on the right path! Spirit! Halt! Are my letters an entreaty to you, or whatever phantom of my father lingers on? King! Father! Royal Dano, answer me! And... Yet the faster my pen flies, O Horatio, the more certain I am that these hastening litters shall never reach thee, that every word is a cry into an abyss. I am Hamlet, Prince of Denmark. By heaven, I charge thee, speak! Speak! How could my own father torture me thus? Those years I had looked up to him, respected him. Nay. Never loved him. I am a Hamlet, Prince of Denmark. Have I not avenged your death, O Phantom? She's dead. She's dead in his all because of you. Yeah. 